If anybody is curious what is going on, this is a uh, brand new hydroponic garden and I've been asked not to release it yet and I'm just doing testing on it for them and so far I've been pretty happy. As a matter of fact, uh, in terms of what I see so far is it's very close to an aero garden and it has a uh, nice front um, display. Now one of the things about it though is that it doesn't have a touch display and so you have to go over to like the uh, buttons on the right where you say enter and that gives you things like variety and settings and uh, also there's a back button so it takes a little bit to get used to but the display gives you things such as the uh, temperature, humidity, uh, the time and military time, uh, very nice uh, water level uh, inside of it um, that uh, gives you the uh, time to uh, add water and it has the days of growth as well. So it puts up uh, a lot of features such as uh, the first part of the uh, germination cycle and then it switches over to a growth cycle and you could uh, set details on those and there are 12 sites on the uh, deck you know in terms of growth sites the uh, light is 36 watts and I measured uh, the light output using phototone in the center and it just blew me away. As a matter of fact, it's very strong in the center and right around the outside edges at the six and a half above deck inches, um, I'm getting about uh, 500 ppfd on the uh, sides here. Now these uh, plants are red velvet microdorf tomato plants, whereas uh, the ones on the other side are Heartbreaker Dora Red, and they're a little bit larger plant. So what's going to happen is I'm going to probably have to move some of these plants out. The Doras are a little bit large to keep in this, um, but these uh, Red Velvet uh, Microdorfs should be okay to uh, spread across and grow underneath this light. Now one of the things about a 12 uh, site garden is that if you have two plants, you know, it's pretty darn easy to space those out, but with three plants, it's a little bit more difficult because you don't have uh, a site in the middle here to do one, two, three. But aside from that, the uh, tomato plants so far have germinated and they're growing quite well and I've been very pleased with the unit. So hopefully the manufacturer is going to give me permission to release the brand and the model to you soon. However, I wanted to just be able to uh, let you know what I'm doing currently in terms of uh, testing out new products.